Hello, it's Donna with Dollar Tree Hauls and more with Donna. I know it's been about a week since I've actually been on here and uh, because I have a lot of videos that I'm trying to edit and put up. Uh, the craft collab I just did. I also have a cookie collab I'll be doing on Friday. I have my video of all my Christmas ornaments, the Sea Life themed Christmas ornaments and the pictures of my Christmas tree. If you're not on my Instagram or my Facebook, which I already have the Christmas tree up. So anyway, but I do have a little small Dollar Tree haul uh, for you today and you will want to watch it till the very end because I have a special little Christmas surprise at the end. Um, or somewhere, somewhere in this video, let's just put it that way, because I'm going to need you to pay attention to all of the rules, which I may just kind of scatter throughout. Okay. So, cause it's not going to be this comment below and I'll pick one. That's not what's going on. So, I mean, not originally anyway, but we'll get into it soon. Anyway, my name is Donna. I'm with Dollar Tree Hauls and more with Donna. And let's get with this Dollar Tree haul that I have today. Uh, one of the first things I wanted to show you will be going in my coffee giveaway that I'll be having in the month of December. This is just called Light Up Decor. It is Greenbrier. Um, it does have a little tab on the back with the LED light in the middle. And I have not seen this yet. So it just says coffee and I thought it would be great on a coffee bar or something for my... Um, coffee giveaway so i add uh there was some other one other thing i wanted to put in the coffee giveaway but i haven't seen it yet so um i need to quit buying stuff to go in it and so if i don't find it between now and the time i do the coffee giveaway it will not go in the coffee giveaway but anyway um i'm not gonna tell you what it is it's a surprise but um anyway this was for my coffee giveaway and then um i wanted to show you one thing that cousin Jan um, got me, but I'll show you in, when I get to it. But she is, she found some things on my wish list, which I can't wait to get them in the mail so I can show you with my next haul. Um, anyway, I picked up these because they're so cute. It has the gnomes, they're gnome gift tags. And uh, I'll use one of them for my um, gnome giveaway. This one is adorable. And the bottom half of it has some really cute little gift tags, too. I just thought those were so cute, 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 cute. So, this is just Christmas house. Gift tags, there's 52 pieces. And I had been looking for the ones with the gnomes. Adorable. And you could, if you make your own uh, greeting cards, uh, those would be so cute uh, for your own greeting cards if you make them. Uh, these little hats are squished on this one, but anyway, we'll fix it. Anyway, I uh, was very excited to to find those finally. Another little item. I've seen this before, but I had to get it. I don't know why. <laughs> I used to work with some people who really loved this, and I just started a new job today, matter of fact. So I'm still in training and will be in training for a couple more weeks, but um, through Christmas and um but anyway, it's, it's, this is really cute. It has a little cocoa on the side and it says joy, but it's the little, um, red, uh, camper and he's a little container. You can put cookies or something in. So, um, I may put cookies in it. You never know. So anyway, I just thought he was so cute and I just went ahead and picked him up because I thought he was cute. Um, now I may have another friend who really likes campers. We'll find out. Uh, then I picked up. Um, something that will be a Christmas gift. It is Star Wars Cup. And it has the um, child. I don't know his official name because I don't watch The Mandalorian anymore. But uh, he was just a child when I was watching it. But anyway, he's on that. It says Star Wars. This is a Christmas gift for somebody who really likes that show. Um, I also picked up another new a gift bag. Um, cosmetic bag, sorry. This one says Glam Squad on it. It's Greenbrier, um, just cosmetic bag. And um, this is a heavy little uh, plastic material. It'll hold quite a bit in there. I'm always giving away cosmetics and stuff in my um, giveaways. And so I thought that would make a nice little uh, gift for somebody. Which reminds me, I do have a 400 subscriber giveaway that I cannot wait to give away, but I'm not at 400 subscribers yet. Um, I get going from 385, 386, 385, 385. I don't know if it's a problem with YouTube or what the issue is, but 
I would really like to get to 400. I was wanting to get to 500 by Christmas, but I can't even get to 400 by December. So if you guys can help me out by sharing my video, liking, commenting, um, thumbs up, uh, subscribing, I would really appreciate it. Uh, okay, next. I picked up another one of these as a gift, the ombre tote bag. I'd already picked up one. I picked up another one for a gift. And I picked these up for Christmas gifts because I had, I've seen these at the Dollar Tree before, but I had not seen the strawberry. Um, I have seen the caramel truffles, Sherwood, four pieces. Uh, just premium milk chocolate with caramel filling. I'd seen those before. They make good, uh, really cool things to put into a gift basket. Uh, premium milk chocolate truffles by Sherwood, four pieces. But this one is strawberries, and I had never seen the strawberry with the white chocolate. It says strawberry cream filled premium white chocolate truffles. This one's Brazilian, 100% cocoa, and this one is from Lagano. So it's a different brand, and I had never seen, uh, the like I said, the strawberry with the white chocolate. So I thought that would be a cute little gift to put in somebody's just extra little gift in their gift bag. Or a gift basket if you are going to make one. Um, I picked this up for a friend who really likes buffalo or not buffalo what do you call this animal print <laughs> so there's a lady that i know at my church that really likes uh this is juncture it's a little wristlet and she really is into animal print so i bought this for her for christmas and to go with some other stuff obviously <laughs> not by itself uh i also bought this for some gifts, um, probably break it up into three different gifts. It's fashion pins, includes three ballpoint pins, they bright black, but they are the bumblebees, which are very, very popular. Um, one of them just has honeycomb, one of them has bees, and the other one has, yeah, they have, they're gray with bees. And they have, these are three piece sets, they have them right now out for Christmas gifts. They have other, other prints, but when I saw the bees, I had to get it. And you know me, I picked these socks up. They're Juncture Men 6 to 12 with footballs on them. This is a Christmas gift for somebody who is really into football. And I believe the rest of this is, nope, I'll we'll just get to it when we get to it, y'all. Uh, this is for my cousin Jan. My cousin Jan uh, gave me this. They are not from the Dollar Tree. I believe they're from the Family Dollar Store. Um, but I'm not sure. If it could be Dollar General. They're DIY fun felt stickers. You get a six count. And they just have little mugs on them, like cocoa mugs. And it says, Comfort and Joy, Snowflakes, and Merry Christmas. Oh, those are so cute. You could do that for use them for crafting or put them on an envelope for your Christmas gifts. And she was kind of thinking about my coffee giveaway when she picked them up. So, um, I may put them in my coffee giveaway. You never know. Or I might. It's a little late for DIY right now because we are so, I have so much to do and we have a craft show this weekend and I'm not even sure if we'll be able to do another one before Christmas. I'm hoping to pick up another one soon or find another place to set up because we have so many crafts and I just can't do any more crafts. So, if I kept this for crafts, it would have to be for next year's Christmas crafts. But I thought this was really, really super cute and um, thank you, Jim. All right, my... Uh, for those of you who are on my YouTube, uh, not YouTube, on my um, Facebook account, you may have seen me put out a prayer request for my little cousin, Canaan. Um, and so I wanted to go ahead and mention it on my channel. Uh, his name is Canaan. He is my first cousin's uh, little boy. And he is 11 years old. And he... Uh, has Gilliam Bar disease. Uh, we don't really know how it happened. Um, he just all of a sudden couldn't walk and uh, then he started to get choking on a burrito. And so he is at Texas Children's Hospital and uh, has been there for over a week now. And if you could pray for him, he's 11 years old. His name is Canaan. And um, we are hoping for a full, complete recovery with the. Uh, He's had his infusions to help with it, 
and he is get, uh, we'll be going through some physical therapy this week and next week, and hopefully we'll be home before Christmas, And um, but he needs a lot of prayer, so if you could pray for him, I really would appreciate it. So uh, some of this is for him and his little brother. Uh, my cousin has three boys. One of them is grown and in college, and the other ones are younger. So um, she has one that is 11, and the other one I think is seven. I can't keep up with them. <laughs> I'm getting old myself. Um, but anyway, I picked up some new um, stickers. Uh, I picked up because I have not seen the, um, these are from Crafter Square Gemstone Designs. You get two pieces of the um, stickers. I have not seen the pink butterflies before. Um, I just thought these were gorgeous. I picked up two of them. Uh, so I may use one and Dina may use one. Or I may give one away. I'm not sure. But I picked up one and picked up two just in case. So I'd have an extra. But these are gorgeous. They are really good for crafting. Uh, so I didn't pick those up. Uh, random item here. Um, but this is the Frosted Cranberry Yardley London with orange and grapefruit oils. Um, you'll know I'm really bad about picking up this soap and not using it. But I think my mom wants this one. So uh, I'm going to give it to her. Because I just limited edition cranberry frosted cranberry. I just couldn't not pick it up because it smells so good. So I mentioned it to her and I think she wants it. So I'm going to put it in her Christmas bag. Okay. Uh, the rest of this is for, uh, mostly for, uh, it's for Kanan and his little brother Crayden. Uh, got him a little basket to take to him whenever they get home because he'll be at home probably still going through physical therapy and, and recovering. And so I wanted him to have some things I could play with in the house. Um, cause he was very active and played baseball and soccer and all kinds of things before. So it'll be a while till he gets back to that. But so I wanted to have some extra little things for him to do. So I picked up these mini Uno cards. Um, they're Uno go pocket size cards, fun on the go play. And I actually picked up a, a package for myself as well. Um, used to love to play, you know, when I was younger. So I picked that up for him. Great score from the Dollar Tree. I also picked up, some of this is for him. Some of it's for his little brother. Um, it's Maze Labyrinth. And it has sea lifey stuff in it. It has a turtle and a fish and a dory fish. And it just says Maze Labyrinth th uh, 3 and up by... Arrive, I think is the name of the brand. It's just imported by Greenbrier. And so anyway, um, you have those little balls and you try to move it around the maze. And this is a really fun thing that you can just do and just kind of hold it like a tablet and kind of can just do and sit in front of the TV or whatever. Um, really wish I could get it to him while he's at the hospital because I know that he could use that. Um, but I won't be going to Houston. I just started a new job, so it's going to be hard for me to uh, to cat, get away and go down there. So uh, I'll get it to when he gets back. This is a Minions Splatums. It's a Series 2 by Mattel for 4 and up. And um, it just has a little launcher thing that you launch it. And then it goes across the room. And um, it says there's five pieces in here. So I'm not really sure if it has that little tower thing with it. And you just launch it and it sticks to here. Y'all, I don't really know how it works. I just know it's called Minions, the Rise of Guru Splatums. And I really love the Minions. Can't wait for the Rise of Guru. I want to go see that movie. But um, I wanted to get in one of those. So I got those for the boys. Um, whichever one wants to play with it. I also picked up these. It says there's 12 discs to collect. And I may go pick up some more stuff too. Uh, this is a disc launcher with two mystery discs. And um, it's Nerf or Nothing. Forever Clever. So it's a Nerf brand. It's kind of like a, one of those surprise bags. I forget what y'all call them. But um, it just says disc launchers with two mystery discs. And those are the ones that you can get. Uh, they are hockey teams, I believe. Um, maybe not. I don't think they're hockey teams. It's just all Nerf. But they look like hockey team logos to me. So I think it's just all Nerf teams. But they have all these different ones that you can collect. And so, grab bag. Is that what you call them? Grab bag? Mystery bags? I don't know. What call them, you know. I got that for them. <laughs> uh, and then I picked up three 
And this is the last thing, yeah. I picked up three of these because I thought they were a really good deal from Color Forms, and I've seen a lot of people hauling them. Um, I picked up Guess Who and the game Guess Who. I picked up Monopoly and I picked up Battleship. So I used to love to play both of these games when I was a little girl. Uh, Battleship and Monopoly, loved to play them when I was a kid. So I went ahead and picked up both of these. We had them both and I really enjoyed both of these. So I went ahead and picked these two up. And then the guess who I thought would be really fun, especially for the younger one. So I picked those up and that is the end of my Dollar Tree haul. Um, I do have some giveaways coming up for the month of December and I need to hurry up and get them done so I can get everything mailed into you all before December. And so I will be working on getting those together this weekend after my craft show and um, trying to get everything together so I can record it and tell you what you need to do to win those giveaways so we can get them sent off uh, early December and you can get it all before Christmas. So, um... Here is how this is going to work. Uh, each giveaway will have a different set of rules uh, for how to win. Every giveaway will be USA only, not Canada or outside of the continental United States. You will need to be 18 years old. You will have to be subscribed to my channel to win. If you're not subscribed to my channel, I need to be able to go to your channel and see that I am one of the people that you subscribe to. Um, that is a must. <laughs> because I, this is to give back to my subscribers who've been supporting me all year since I started back in April. So, uh, and I appreciate it so much. It's not that I don't want new subscribers to win because I do, but I want you to actually be subscribed to my channel because I love every one of my subscribers, new or old. Um, so anyway, this is a two part giveaway. There are two different things, uh, sets of stuff that I'm giving away here. And, uh, Two different giveaways but it's the same thing so there's two sets uh, four and it's the same thing so let me show you what you will win there will be two winners um, to shape on shipping so these are the 2022 12 month calendars from the Dollar Tree we're gonna start off with the farmers market calendar and these are great for crafters will also be great gifts right here before Christmas you will get the Farmer's Market uh, Farm Fresh with the truck on it. And that's what the back of it looks like. Uh, you will get the uh, Thankful, Grateful, and Blessed, which is my favorite, I think. I already started cutting these out on the one I have to start making magnets soon. I thought I was going to get them done with this craft show, but it won't happen. But that one will be in there. And the Farmhouse Calendar. And this one is also super cute. This is the back of it. So you will get four calendars. If you're a winner, you'll get all four of these calendars. And I have another set because I was blessed uh, by cousin Jan and some other subscribers. And I uh, have plenty for crafting. Dean and I have both have plenty to do with the crafting that we need with the ones that we were blessed with. And then we also picked up some when we finally found them. We have plenty, so uh, I wanted to share with my subscribers. So you, you get all four of those calendars uh, in one set, and then there's another four in another set. So there's going to be two winners to this giveaway. Okay, this is what you will need to do other than being 18 years old, subscribe to my channel, living inside the USA. I bought these calendars or my subscribers or someone, Cousin Jan, this is not sponsored by YouTube or paid for by YouTube. So, you will need to answer some of the questions below correctly. If you answer the questions correctly, you will go into a drawing and uh, you will be able, you know, I will pick the winner from the drop for those who have the answers correctly. So, these are the answers, these are the questions. And, um, so you will need to have know a little bit about me or have watched some of my videos before. Number one question. I am certified in a particular activity. What am I certified in? That's your first question. I am certified in one particular activity and that I really uh, enjoy doing. Uh, and you need to tell me what that activity is below. Put number one, and the name. So you'll need to put 
the answers to all these questions in one answer. Okay, so don't just go in there right now and put it down because I'm going to need you to write it down and then put all of your answers into one post. Okay, number two, I have a pet. What is her name? <laughs> She's a she. So there's your little hint. I have a pet and what is her name? That is the second question. Okay, I have a pet. What is my pet's name? Number three. I live in a house with another family member. Who do I live with? What family member? You don't have to tell me her, her name. You just need to tell me who she is. <laughs> Another hint. Okay. So Donna, do you have to get all three of the answers right? Yes. All three of those answers have to be correct to go into the giveaway. What if nobody answers all three correct? then whoever answers the most correct will go in the giveaway. If only two people answer all of those correct, then those two people automatically win these calendars. So if you don't want these calendars, you don't need to enter the giveaway. If you already have a bunch of these calendars, you know, unless you want to give them away to somebody else and share them and pay it forward, then you don't necessarily need, may not want to enter the giveaway. But if you would love to have these calendars, please answer those three questions. You only have 24 hours to watch this video, answer those three questions. After 24 hours, nope. So 24 hours from the time that I posted it. So I'm planning on posting it this week on Thursday. So Friday or Saturday morning, I'm gonna look at whoever answered all these questions or Friday night when I get home. Uh, whatever the 24 hours is later, which will probably be Friday night, I will look to see who answered those questions correctly, put them in a giveaway, and my next video, which will be early next week, Tuesday, we'll say Tuesday, um, I will pick the winner so I can get these mailed off. Thank you so much for watching all of this craziness. I appreciate it very much. I love you all. And please have a wonderful week. Please hit a thumbs up button. Please comment below. Um, please hit the notification bell. Please subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. I hope you all had a wonderful Thanksgiving. And I'm so excited about Christmas. And so I'm going to start wearing my Christmas clothes. Today's still November. So <laughs> next video, I'm going to be wearing some Christmas shirts or something. Uh, have some headbands and stuff and I'll try to make it a little bit more festive and fun for you all. Anyway, thank you for watching and God bless you.